We got breaking news right now involving OBJ, Odell Beckham Jr., ladies and gentlemen. I'm here to tell you he has signed the one-year deal worth $18 million with the Baltimore Ravens. It's going down, ladies and gentlemen, I'm telling you. Um, the Raven, this is this is crazy. This news is just breaking. You know, oh, everybody's reporting on this right now. The Ravens got it done. You know, it, we thought it was going to be Dallas. We thought it was going to be, you know, the Jets. We thought it was going to be numerous teams, but it turned out that is is the Baltimore Ravens. You know, um, they have, they have agreed. You know, and this is being reported by NFL Network's Ian Rappaport. You know, uh, like I stated, one year deal when he got the bag, the chicken, the onion, you know, um, the former Super Bowl champion. I just I, of course, it sucked, you know, with the with the injuries, the, the back to back ACL tears. But I believe that Odell Beckham, Jr., we got to remember, like this dude wasn't the most electrifying man in football at a point in time. You know, clearly when he's healthy, he's one of the best receivers in the game. And he proved that with his latest run with the Los Angeles Rams, Odell Beckham, age 30, Last played for the Rams back in 21, where he was a key part of that Super Bowl title. You know, we got to make it seem. Don't act like he just was one of the dudes just riding the pond. No, no, no. Odell Beckham Jr. was out there making things happen. You know, so this is crazy. We still don't know what's going to take place with... Um, with my man Jackson, Lamar Jackson, obviously that situation is going to spice up some more, you know, with this, with this recent move, you know, but I think the Ravens, man, they're a threat, man, seriously. And this guy's back in the division, you know, where he played again with, with the Cleveland Browns. I don't know if y'all remember that, you know, so he, he clearly familiar with what's going on here. You know, you got the Cincinnati Bengals, you got, like I said, the Browns, you got the Steelers, it, 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 that this division is about to get rampant. You understand? Um, but this is a three, like I said before, future Hall of Famer, three-time Pro Bowler. You know, um, well, let me know y'all thoughts on the situation, though, involving, you know, Odell Beckham Jr. getting picked by the Baltimore Ravens. I think that's, that's, that's wild, in my humble opinion. I don't think nobody would have seen this one coming. You know, uh, Lamar Jackson got himself a new weapon. Hopefully things can get figured out, you know, but this basic, like I said, it's an invitation, you know, um, for Lamar Jackson, to be honest with you, you know, you better, you, 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 I think he might want to sign after this, you know, you know, it, it's crazy. You know, they got to get it done. You know, Baltimore is, is, is getting their weapon situated, to be honest with you. And they secured this deal, which was massive. You know, Odell had a lot of meetings. We got to remember it was, what was it, with Arizona? You know, I believe he was having a private meeting with the Arizona Cardinals, you know. But for whatever, I don't know what happened with that. Uh, it was with NFL owners as well. You know, so it, it, it's crazy that Odell has changed his fortune because it seemed like nobody wanted him, you know, but now is 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 definitely the truth, you know, um, that this has happened. I, I, I obviously Odell wanted the bag and, and the Baltimore Ravens put the chicken on the bag. You know, I, I don't know what, what these other teams was pushing for. You know, it says Odell sources have told us has discussed with teams the idea of signing for 13 million. So basically what I'm hearing is Odell wanted to sign for 13 million at first. He was trying to get somewhere in that range. You know, obviously teams was trying to lowball him. But come on, man. What he did for the for the LA Rams, like I said, he 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 laid out on the field, you know. And prior to tearing his ACL again, he put on an amazing touchdown play. He put points on the board in the Super Bowl. You know, so he was a deadly weapon. And and you put him on some of these teams, like I said, you know, with with this receiving call, like I said, with Lamar Jackson, with his dual threatness, you know, we, we've seen when Odell got a competent quarterback, you know, and we've seen what he does, you know, so we got to just definitely give major credit on that. You know, uh, I love what I'm seeing from the Baltimore Ravens. I think that they're going to be a dangerous threat. You know, they got... Rashad Bateman, you know, uh, Nelson Aguilar, you know, Andy Isabella, Mike Thomas, Tylen Wallace, you know, they got they got some decent, decent pieces out here, you know, but I think the combination of Odell and Lamar Jackson changes everything, you know, because we've seen Odell with Stafford, you know, this guy, uh, Lamar Jackson, I'm telling you, when him and um, 
Lamar Jackson and the matchup between Deshaun Watson. That could be a, a Super Bowl matchup fight. And obviously you have, you know, Joe Burrow to throw in the mix in there. And it, this division ain't taking no prisoners. So, but the one thing I will give Odell a, a, a big time leap in is he knows the division. He understands what's going on here. You know, he played in this division. So I think that this is going to serve him well. He understands exactly what's the task at hand for Baltimore. So, and, and mind you, when he was with the Cleveland Browns, Baltimore was laying, laying the pine on him. So it's, let's see what happens. Uh, next season, this division is going to heat up even more now with him being thrown in the mix. You know, but it's unfortunate that other teams couldn't bring that paper. You know, but Odell got paid. I, I'm happy because... They was trying to lowball Odell Beckham Jr. off that knee. He's been working tirelessly. Odell Beckham Jr. will be ready to roll. His rehab process looked excellent. You know, let's not act like he's not a top athlete, you know, for real. You know, his speed is there. His he, The man can catch with, the, with some of the best to ever do it. You know, uh, we've seen him obviously start off with the New York Giants. You know, things didn't work out for him you know, with the Giants. But now, you know, he had went to Cleveland. Things didn't really work out for him. You know, Cleveland, they sent him, obviously, to L.A., you know, to the Rams. And uh, nobody expected them to just take off the way they did, even though when he got to the Rams, it was hype, too. You know, they was hosting the Super Bowl, you know, and they and they got it done, you know. So give a major, give a major credit, you know, that they got that Super Bowl, you know. So I'm just, I'm just excited. For the Los Angeles Rams, man. Uh, not the Rams, pardon me, the Baltimore Ravens. But the Rams, on the other hand, l l let's see what they going to do. You know, um, they, they, they've they elected to not bring back Odell Beckham Jr. I think Odell is in a great situation to make them pay. You know, and to bring Baltimore back to where Baltimore need to be. You know, and I, people are sleeping on Odell Beckham Jr. They acting like it's time to throw the nail in the coffin. You know, I still think he could be a number one wide out, you know, and and Lord have mercy if he's two or three. And somebody, like I stated before, you don't know what, what else is going to take place. But I, I don't think Odell signs this contract without having a conversation with Lamar Jackson. I do believe this, this, this play is to play with a guy like Lamar Jackson. You don't make a decision like this, like I stated before, if you ever had a conversation with Lamar Jackson. No way, in my humble opinion. You know, so I'm just excited for, for Odell Beckham Jr. OBJ, man, the start of something special. The next chapter of his career has finally begun. You know, um, he could put some of this injury woes, hopefully, behind him. And let's get another championship out this whole thing, man. Let's show people why you was one of the best to ever do it. It's Flight Sports TV. Hit that subscribe button. Peace and love. OBJ is signed. One year, $18 million with the Baltimore Ravens. It's breaking news.